Hey, Siri Thinker, welcome! Fluent 113 just released and with it a very expected feature. Now we can use the famous fly menu of Fluent to edit your Fluent object when you want. Well, I'm going to show to you how it works and a few cases where this function makes modelings of Fluent. Let's get started! First thing you need to know to can use this function. You must uncheck this option in preferences. Why? Because Fluent use a template of modifier stack, so uncheck it to keep a good stack. Now we create an object with Fluent and add few bevels. We get Fluent. Ok, select the object and call the Pi menu. Click on Edit. At this moment, I'm back to the usual Fluent environment. Hold the left click to display the Fly menu and everything works as usual. In my opinion and experiences, the case where the edit function is the most used is after a slice operation. Just three examples. This first example is the same as in the teaser. This is another example made in the teaser. In this last example, I show to you how I make the lighting part of my model. If you use Fluent since few times and become an advanced user, Fluent 113 introduces three shortcuts. <laughs> 113, three, three shortcuts. <laughs> okay, one to cut, another to slice, and the last one to edit. Shortcuts avoid the pie menu and allow us to faster work. Like it, Fluent follow your skill progression. It was a quick and focused video, I hope it helped you. Other video will come, so subscribe to Don't Miss Blender Tutorial and other Fluent topics. See you soon, bye bye.